Prince Harry was overcome with emotion during a touching moment with Meghan Markle in his new Netflix documentary Heart of Invictus. His wife brought the prince to the stage at the opening ceremony of the Invictus Games in 2020, and after she called him he appeared teary-eyed. Watch the touching moment in the video below. Addressing the crowd, Meghan said, Good evening everyone, thank you so much for your service and to all the family and friends here who have supported you along the way because this is a service. Welcome to Royal Experts. If you are new here, do not forget to subscribe and press the notification bell so that you do not miss any news. This is Dedication and this is the Invictus family. Please welcome to the stage my wonderful husband, Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex. Harry appeared overwhelmed with emotion and kissed his wife before replying, Thank you, my love. Meghan looked very beautiful at the event, as she wore a stunning black and white outfit consisting of a white ruffled off-shoulder top and wide black pants. She also wore a pair of black Manolo Blahnik heels. The documentary, released on Wednesday, goes behind the scenes of the Duke's incredible tournament in 2014. In the documentary, Harry spoke candidly about his mental health and the lack of support he felt around him after returning from serving in Afghanistan. The biggest struggle for me was the people, he explained, adding, no one around me could really help. I didn't have that support structure, that network or expert advice to determine what was really going on. With me? Unfortunately, like me, the first time you really think about therapy is when you're lying on the floor in the fetal position, and you're probably wishing you had dealt with some of this stuff earlier. That's what I really want to change. According to the official website, the games harness the power of sport to inspire recovery, support rehabilitation, and generate a broader understanding and respect for those who serve their country. The Invictus Games are about more than just sport, they capture hearts, challenge minds and change lives. The games last about a week, and involve up to 550 competitors, with the nine core sports and flexibility for additional activities and competitions, including e-sports. Sports range includes, wheelchair rugby, weightlifting, sitting volleyball and swimming. The first Invictus Games were held in March 2014 at the Queen Elizabeth Olympic Park in London. The Invictus Games are designed for wounded, injured, ill-served and former military personnel. This year, the tournament will be held in Dusseldorf, Germany, and will be held from September 9th to 16th. Thanks for watching until the end.